Hey everyone, Son of Beast and Terry Crews here. This is NHL Stanley Cup Playoffs 24 on EA Sports. What's going on guys? Son of Beast here and Terry Crews here. Today's a matchup. We are ready to send you to game four of the NHL Stanley Cup Playoffs. The next matchup, we're ready to see the rematch of the Avalanche and the Jets back at Canada's Life Century. The next commentary I will have, it's all you called for. It's OJ with Silver Spoon and Paintbrush here with the three commentaries on the bench. And while following along with the center ice, we'll all be determined to go with now is Fan. We'll be back with the post game show right after this one. It's now a 2-1 series score, as the Avalanche already won in the third game. But can they dominate it again to tie this up? We'll find out what goes next. Let's get started, folks. We'll see you all later after the game. Hey, everyone, it's OJ, and we are back in Winnipeg, ready for game four of the Avalanche and the Jets. The starting goaltenders in between the Georgiev and Masai for the new starting goaltender for the Winnipeg Jets. On to game four. Here we go. We start things off here. Chai Pillow will start it off. Likely with the puck steal. This would stop by Brosit. That will be his first save of the night in game four. Now he's definitely one of the baddest. All you know you can definitely say here is Brosit. He just made that one with a lot of his attempting saves here tonight. We'll find out if he does here for game four. It's always easier enough when you play for this half end you're under game, you may notice it could be coming in here for a better timing at this angle. We'll find out if he does one too. Kyle Connor's got the puck, now we'll have it over to Villardi. Villardi gives the side fill up. Here's Morsey! Morsey on the move around! Trying to get fucking in, but it's stop here by Georgiev. Demelo now finds Villardi. Shot! Stop here by Georgiev! On the rebound is Nick McKinnon. He's now finding again to McCarr. McCarr gets a swipe. Now Morrissey will have it over. Give again to Mordohan. Here's a breakaway chance. The pass! Shot scores! What a shot release for DeMello! That one time goal puts it up 1 0. Now here's the pressure take here. For DeMello, he made this one a great goal. Made a spin around and had that one time angle. That takes a good start here for the Jets. That's her on the board. A great start here for the Winnipeg Jets as they're on the board, one nothing over the Avalanche. Now for the win as the higher skills on the point. Dylan with the puck, now finding it again to Mordehan. Fires it around the corner to the wall to Eiffel. Eiffel, the Dylan shot, almost tipped it in. This will rebound it, saved by Georgiev. Now here's Mordehan. And now O'Connor will have the puck back again to Manson, again to Colton. Here's Colton right toward the wing, trying to defend the puck here. Here's Manson's shot, we don't stop by Brosier. Ah, uh, he's pretty good right now to make his defense. All that covers up everything. A lot of time left in this period. Jets start off with a one nothing lead over the Colorado X. Avalanche wins the faceoff. Oh, and the Dryder got that one, and he takes the puck steal away. Easy to keep an eye on that one for the Dryder. Here's Larry, send it over again to Bianca, and now find Dylan. Dylan, send the pass. Young losses the puck, and it goes out of play, and I'll give it again to Bianca, back to Dylan. Here's the take. The Dryder right toward the corner. Trying to can't find anybody, and that puck leaves his own, and this will attempt to clear it out. Now Bianca will send it over to Dylan again to the Droider. Here's a take to Appleton. Appleton! Oh, that one missed again already there, having a bad pass situation. You're never going to like that one here because if he loses the puck, that's going to be fainting on that one here. You don't want to get this one out of the way too soon. The pass finds the Droider. He finds the pass. Here's a takeaway for Wantonen. Over round! What a save by Brazier! 
It's always the great enough to have the goaltender. Reaction is timing. Here's Perfetti with the puck. Now finally again in Nemstikov, and now Sandberg will have it. Shot! Glove saved by Giordano. He's up for the whistle here, and we'll hold and reset the puck here with under 15 minutes. Lots of time left in this period. one nothing to score for the Jets. Now for the win, here's McCarr. Covered up in the corner, now find Toes. Toes gets back to Toe McCarr, and now again to McKinnon. McKinnon with the puck. Toe in the corner, play like grenade. What a save by Corsier. And that one's going to be a turn out to be a horse. He always had a lost one, but that was a great recovery. You know, it's also amazing what you do for Brissette. It's just how hard you do. The training of it for Brissette has come to be a wishing, and he does it for his own timing to make the save. Now he's the call, we have Nathan McKenna and Carl Connor. Nathan McKenna is one of the unstoppable forces that he has taken all of his response and efforts. He maintains his all the way pressure and we'll find out if he does one. Kyle Connor has his wheels to take all of his opportunity range and has that one here for coming in right toward the back. It's hard one to take over this guys, but if we'll be keeping an eye on here for another takeover. I'll have another takes in between for the next part of the attendant matchups. Back to you. Nathan McKinney in the penalty box. That's going to be like a cross checking. That's right now the Jets are on the power play to start things off for game four. Now the win. Oh, what a shot here by Georgia. Makes a stop with only 13 21 to go. Quick draw releaseman doesn't get a good timing of this effort, but hopefully on that occasionally they will have to like try to figure it out if he can do one. Now as the Colorado wins right now, motorhan has got that puck. Here's a shot! What a save to make your year. That pass to Monahan has been broken up by Jokansen. Perfetti will try to clear that one out. 13 minutes to go in the first period. Send a long pass. Johansson takes a puck steal. Now Perfetti will have it over to get to Velarde. The deep puck firing out missed it. And Icing will attempt here on the Winnipeg Jets as it will stop the clock with 1242. The Jets wins the faceoff. Winnipeg back in the offense now for Monobine. Here's a chance for Velarde. Toes takes the puck steal. The Jets are back in the offense now finding another way to get from here. Finds a pass to Monobon. Monobon! Give the pass over to Shifeli. The pass to Monobon! Well saved by Jerome Easy tough shots. Can't let that happen to be fooled over. Because if something has changed, they can't let them go to work. Now the way to do it our face off, it's still a one nothing game for Winnipeg. Colorado wins the face off as Toes lost to that one as Wagner will have it out with 30 seconds of the power play. Closes out the gap. In the, in the Jets territory now has Connor. Here's a take to Elders and now find Morrissey. Morrissey spins a move. The pass broken up. Kivarante in the zone. Poked it out. He's ready to get back out there, and time is up. And that's it for the power play for the Jets as there it's 0-1 for game four. Y'all, the top way has been doing it for a lot of it to die on this one game. It's very impossible to have that one shot coming in by, but it's not really easy enough to have that one come in. You know, the, the Avalanche wants to clear that thing out. It's not what they usually go for, but it's all that happens. They take it from here, they have it shut him down. The McCarr shot, stopped by Brozier. He will stop that playing puck with this pass to near the midway mark. Colorado wins the faceoff as Manson has it. What a great chance here for the goaltender. And here's I follow on the breakaway chain.
Now that one's a questionary. I don't know about I follow that one with this goal, but great chance. He made that one easy enough. And he's rushing and said, nope, I'm up for it. He just made that goal. What a shot. The race is on here. It's a 2 0 Winnipeg in the first period, nearing the midway mark. And now we pass the midway mark of the first period. Closes up the gap and now find DeMello. Here's a chance here to I follow. Gives it over again to Monahan. Monahan kick the puck. O'Connor has one. Now he swings the pass to Cohen, off to Wood. Wood trying to race his inbound. What a stop for me by the goaltender. Winnipeg back in the offense. Shy Pelly with the puck. Taking his chance right now. Slows it down. Tries to find a high foul to DeMello. But it's Cohen with the puck. Now here's Wood. Wood stops it. Shy Pelly with the puck. Now has it over again to Pion. Pion gives it to Shy Pelly. And he lost that when his ran today. We'll have it over. Back to McKinnon. McKinnon now finds it again at Rantanen. Good block by Morrissey. Now that gets a lot of defenders out of the way for sure. It just happened to be one of the tough ones to get the shots in place. Villardi with the puck trying to hold on right toward the corner. We'll fire it around the net. And now Shifeli will have some time. He needs to go on some offense to go some press breaks. Corner shot. That's blocked. McKinnon, Rantanen, deep pass to Lequidin. And like went on against Pion. Get the pass to McKinnon. What a save. But the power play is on for Colorado after a penalty call on Joe, Josh Morrissey. That's big problems considering already it is not where you start things off. You don't take your time. You don't do it often. And you don't get a thing done. That's going to be a first penalty kill for the Jets. Here's the call now as we have Biko Ranted in. Miko Rantanen has a snipe on a set of ability. He's looking for his look in his offensive play of the territory for his offense and control. Looking for a snipe if he can get that one through. And that one's rejected off by Semberg. And now here's I follow. He will attempt to clear the puck out of here in the Avs territory. Here's a take to DeMello. Oh, they might be going for something. But the puck stays out of the zone. And he will have to fire that one out of here. Toast got the puck, battling along but along the board. Larry, oh, that was a big slam out. Here's the shot. Oh, what a save by Joe Gibbs. Oh, good call out there, but not enough to get a short-handed goal in time because that changes over, and it may not be what you're looking for there. Now the win for the Avalanche, as Colton will have it. One minute for the power play. As McKinnon will have it over to Gannon Gerard shot. Blocked by Sember. Sember clears the puck out with 50 seconds. Now McCarr will have it now again to Josh Hansen. He finds again in Gerard. Oh, not even that time. In around the move. Trying to go for something else. Gerard finds it again. What a block by Nastikov. That is a crutch thing that is going to play out there, hard. Abs back in the attacking zone. Looks like his time is almost about to expire. And that one's blocked again by Sender. Clear the puck. And that will end their power play for the Abs as they're 0-1 for the game. It's better right now. The offense is not picking up their steam again. But this has happened to be one time shot often. This really got into a great game. Bozic's going to hold the puck here with just down to 4, 4.30 to go, nearing down the mark of the first period. Now the win. Toe shot. And that one's off again by the goaltender. Yeah, I'll get back to I follow with a big collision. No penalty called here on Colorado. Good back, good puck rounds. I follow with two. That's why off the mark and it's a stop again by the goaltender. Monahan's got it now. Trying to get the pass. O'Connor breaks the pass up. No two on one. Oh, what a save! Oh, see ya. It's got that one stopped. You know, it's not always easy because that one really turned out to be a close call. What a great stop.
Now the Avalanche wins it. Here's the tug in the toe shot. Good save. 3-3-8 to go in the first period. It's a 2-0 game for the Jets. Now they're off to do it again. Need to find a goal for the Avalanche. Now for the win, here's McCarr. Toe shot. Stick it off by Lillardi. Lillardi will kick it up. Pionk's got it. Here's Lillardi. Going for back in. He scores. That's three in a row for the Jets. All pressuring in there. And the Jets make that one that broke it up the pass. That one's sending in there for good. You know, you can see what Neil Payong does. He made this one backhand beauty. But this one is not. This one does the trick. Beating it and then just hit off the side of the skin. That was going to feel a hurt for them for sure. But he just knocked it in there. I've got great pressure out there. Looks like the Payong got that one with a good go. And the win puts again by the Colorado Avs with 3.06 to go. Byram finds Rantanen. Lost that puck. Will already try to hold on. Here's McKinnon. Toss it as he scores. First goal comes in game four as Rantanen has a close quarter in the game. Now watch what happens. Look at what the pass does. Nathan McKinnon was able to say the, the iron voyage, and he made it unstoppable force clear, and off to Rantanen to get the one-time goal effort. Got that close corner for the gap. Turned out to be great. That's right, guys. When he does his reversal for his unstoppable force, he made this one a lot clearer. He was bumped up on the wall, but he found a good open pass vision. That's a hard one to take over this, but we are happy to have that one here with a good, with good pass and a goal for the Avalanche. Harder shot, he scores! Oh man, the Jets are in full breakout. It's now Kyle Connor's turn to get the goal for the playoffs. The back-to-back -back wins, no problem. They really are stepping it up right now because Kyle Connor made this great one to take. A blocking screen, this one took over for sure. Their extension now is now up by three. The Jets have a four to one score in the first period, but we're looking to see if they can get another goal this time. Takes it down and Smith will have it. Bullard, he gives it over. Kyle Connor firing around the net by Scheinfeli. More than two minutes remaining in the first period. Fires a shot. That's blocked by Lequidin. And Rantanen will have it over. Passing around in between. Lost that puck and Sandberg will give it back to Schmidt. Schmidt will fire that puck out into the Axe territory. The Avalanche will have his own and now he finds Johnson. 1.12 to go and we are down to a final minute remaining in the first period in game four. Now here's Sandberg. Clear the puck out. Valley along for the puck. Great hit here. Sandberg will have it. And Sandberg holds on with the puck. Takes it back to Schmidt. Fires a shot. That one stopped again by Georgiev. And another one takes it in. We're in 30 seconds in the first period. Still a 4 1 game. Now they're ready to do this one again. 4 1's a score in the fourth game. Looking to get in a war in the next one. And that one puts a win here for the Avalanche. Now he finds Jordan. Morrissey watching for offside warning and not finding Novella with the final second in the first. Battling for the loose puck in between. And this one whips out one high and backhand stop. So there you go, that ends the first period. On to a full break chain. Who wants to score? We'll be back for the second. On now to the second period. Glad to have us back at Canada Life Century. Let's get back to the action. And we're off to go in the second period. Have a little great takeovers in between, but let's have your thoughts in between in the first period recap. Guys, well, I really appreciate it with that one. They even like scoring it in between. The Jets are a full power range. They already lost in game three, but it looks like they want to show some spirit off. 
They were never going to let that easy go by. I'm happy to have that one with the courage out there. Yeah, same thing with that. If the Jets keep on scoring in between, we'll find out if he does win. And I'll be happy enough to watch him closely. Forcey shot. Good clubs catch here by Georgiev. Stop the play with under 19 minutes. Now the faceoff is on. It's still a 4-1 game in the second period. Now McCarr has a puck here, and they're having to really get a leopard in. Leveland tries to get over it. Get the pass. Morrissey takes the puck steal. Now Schleifrelli. Over now to Carter. Carter in the, on the right wing. Slows it down. Now he finds Monohan. Monohan trying to look for a cloak over. Finds Connor. Shoots! Well saved by Georgia. He's going to hold it on, which is under 18 minutes. Now they're off to do it again. Face off win for the Avalanche. McCarr gives off to Wood. Wood on his way down with the pressure. Toward his own. Trying to get a going, and that one's going to take a first penalty call in the second period, and there'll be two major penalty calls on Winnipeg. Well, the problem for Dylan had to be a tripping call. It is not going to be easy enough. You're never going to let it settle down. Because something happens to you, you're going to get out of here, and you're going to trip somebody over. Avalanche are adding another power play game. O1 this time. Let's see if they have an answer with O2. Now it's a win here for the Avalanche. Toes has it again to Gerard shot. Oh, I follow! What a block! Uh, he's really like he shows up and says, Nope, I'm taking it. Lowry with the puck. Now finding I follow! He got punched over and now Toes will have it over. Now back again to Gerard. 17 minutes to go in the second period, starting off with a power play as the shot goes wide and high right up to glass. By Ram, lost that one. And Sandberg will try to clean that puck out. His toes gives again to Colton. Pulling on his way down. Sandberg's got it. Colton's got one. And yeah, shot saved by Brozier. And DeMillo will fire it out. Oh, I'm going to take the full shorthanded, but I follow his stuff. And here's Nemstikov. Right toward the middle. Shoots! Saved by Georgiev. And now it's back to Gerard. Slowing it down for 130 seconds. There's the call. Fires it out. Jets holding on to it. By ran back to Johansson. Looks like his time is almost about to expire. By ran shot. Good stop here by Brosia. 0-2 this time for the Avalanche as the power play is not given here. Well, they're really good right now. Without the offense, it looks like they're on a full pressure zone. The fans are very happy right now because they have been playing really well in the defense, and this was not their day because this wasn't turning to be like this at all. But they finally knew it. They're trying to get that one here and smack it out. They've done great. Here's Ellers. Shoots and saved again. That stayed out of the net site, and it's now Gerard. Back to Colton. Here's a take for Gerard. Winnipeg back in the offense now, finding to get to Ellers. Now the shot. And that one stops again, and it's not going to get away this time, and now Gerard will have it. Gerard can't hold on to the puck. Ellers will take it. He goes down. Shai trying to battle along with the puck. Colorado back in the offensive zone, trying to pick up some more room. He's up again, back to Gerard. Gerard trying to swing it around. Watching cut it. There's a new substitution on a line group. He finds Benson. Good stop by I follow. Here's the pressure. Gonna go for two. Oh my goodness, another huge stop here by Georgia. That stays on the net. Well, you're gonna have that chance in there because I follow would have had a good chance. Good shot take, but that didn't go through at all. Now back to Velarde. 12.15 left to go in the second period. He finds Morsi. Gives off to Connor. Connor 
Lost that puck, and there's the penalty call. That's going to be on Colorado. Well, there's one way that this is not going to happen now. You're going to make a cross-checking. This is calling the interference. You're not going to let that happen already, and they're going to get that one back call. Miko Wernton in the penalty box. They will get another power play this time for the Jets as they're 0 for 1. Now winner number 10. It's still a 4-1 game for the Jets. The Jets wins the faceoff. Morrissey will try to clear that one out and now we'll have it over to get the Monohan. Takes his time, now finds Connor. Monohan try to grab it. Kicks the puck back to Villardi. Good puck moving here, movement here, good, good passing between for the Jets. They keep it alive, now find Morrissey, shot. Barkander, not enough to get through. 11.09 left to go in the second period. Lots of time left right now, as we already come to a midway, nearing the midway mark of the period. Colorado wins the faceoff as Manson cleared the puck out. Recovered by the Jets. He almost got it now. Back into the attacking zone. Spins around again up by Malardi. And here's a take. Manson takes a puck steal. Recovered it by the Jets. Now they're back in the offense. Oh, that is a big hello moment. Now there is no way to answer that one here. There's going to be a slam to the call. Morrissey now finds again a perfetti. Sure, that's stopped again. Young, and the goaltender comes in with a poke check. Monahan right toward the corner, now finding again the perfetti. Perfetti to move it, and Giro again makes another save. He will stop here with just only 10-1 to go in the second period. Lots of time left to get right to this spring. It's still a 4-1 still a game. Avalanche wins the faceoff. Johnson clears the puck out. Looks like Manson is getting to get back out there. Dyer goes back to the Perfetti. Now he finds it in the Amstikov. Shot and what a save put by, by Georgia. Well, they're really going for the offense right now. I can definitely feel you. Their defenses are on a hard range. It's not what they always do. They make it easier to act. He scores. Cogliano with the goal. Now has their team back down by two. Now, I got to be clear on that one. Cogliano made that one again over by Bursa. He just had that one with this time angle here, and he just made that one with a good shot. That angle is going to be like a takeover one, but it's not very easy when you take over with the line. That scrimmage is going to be a hard play to get. Their current legend is down by two, and they're looking to see if they can get this close game. We're passing a midway mark in the period. Now the wing for the Winnipeg Jets. He finds Monohan. He goes down, trying to hold on with the puck. Here's Rantanen on his way down. Takes a slam. Oh, whoa! The Jet goes crashing down on the Avalanche player. That's where the collision starts. They're never going to let that one go away. All right, fellow, we'll have that puck. Spins around again. Try! Doesn't deflect it in that time as the driver has one. Tries to do the same move, and he makes another big stop. I follow, keep again to Morrissey. The pass again to DeMello. He's I follow. I follow, moves it. Auto shot save, and the goaltender comes loose. Now back and over again. Morrissey gives it to DeMello. As the puck just goes broken, now the full pressure coming in. Here's the driver. Shoot! Stop again by Georgia. And they're still going. The middle! Trying to put a rebound, but it's been knocked loose again by Georgia. Uh, the chance was not always great enough. Now, possible it is when you defend it. A lot of time left in this period. Still 4 2 game with 7 minutes. Jets wins the faceoff. Horsey shot! Holding it back here by Georgia. 
Here's the moon. No deflection in here. And here's Appleton. Holding on with the puck. And it's still going. Back to the Dryer. Here's the shot for Morrissey. What a big stop by Gio again. Oh my gosh. Well, they really are full in pressure range. Not for long enough. But you won't mess that up. The Jets win it. Shot! Oh, I don't think he was ever going to do that. Lowry has it. Here's a chance. Doesn't have that time. It's Dronin will have it. Now Paris will clear the puck out of here. And now back to Dronin. He lost that puck as Morrissey will have it over. And that one has broken up the pass. Toes. Over now again. Finding the outside. And that one's taking over. Here comes Shifeli. Go for 2 on one Timing to get over this with a two on one fast break. Uh, that's a big little bit of loss out there. Too bad, couldn't handle it. Stick lifted, recovered by Velarde. And they will have to leave it offside for now, which is only under five minutes to go. The Colorado Avalanche wins it again. Manson. Goes offside too. Still a lot of time left in this period. Looks like it's going to be a close battle between the American team and the, and the Canadian team. Now the toss up wins it over for Winnipeg. He finds Shai Kelly. And their team goes out of here. Dronin trying to hold it on. He finds it again in Johansson. Good save by Prusia. Now Schmidt will have it over, and that pass can't handle it. Rosette's going to hold on with that puck, up just under four minutes to go. Winnipeg wins the faceoff, and Schmidt will get that one out of here, and now he finds again to eye follow. Takes a snatch in the corner. I follow, recovers it. Here he comes. Oh, that one's a big moment. Almost had that gold knocked it in. McKinnon's got it now. Finds where it in. Uh oh, there's another penalty call. Yeah, that's a big problem. I guess Shemin didn't really think he was going to get this one close. But that is not good. That is going to be a big penalty call, and it's another one for Winnipeg. They're going to add another power play, and it's going to be a close game. Now whenever power play comes in, 0-2 for Colorado. As Colorado wins the faceoff, here's Barrea. That one gets off the skater and Appleton will try to get the Namstick off to clear the puck out. Behind the net is by Ram. Under three minutes remaining in the second period, still a close game now. And here's Lekkonen. Out the shot. Can't hold on with that one as Pionk has it to Appleton. Clearing the puck out of his own. 235 left to go as by Ram will have it over again to Lekkonen. Lekkonen trying to make his way down. That blocks the pass. And Dylan will clear the zone out. Bowling kicking for a loose puck. The Avalanche are back in the offense now finding Tronin. Appleton clears the puck in and lifts it up into the Avalanche territory. Fire Rams got it now. Gives again to Lequidin. Under two minutes remaining and only 30 seconds for their Avalanche power play. Here's John in the target. What a save here by Brozier. Hooks it out. Now here's another one for a chance for Dylan. Can't clear the puck out. Looks like he's ready to get back out there. And here comes Ellers, trying to go for shorthanded! Oh, that timing went off. Well, that's pretty easy enough now, because this one's not getting any closer if he gets there first. Now the Jets are back in the offense. The driver with the puck. They're in a the final minute in the second period, and gets a shot, 
Well, saved by Georgia. Under a minute to go right now. Still a 4-2 game. And now they're ready to do another face-off. The critical draw has been between the opponents and also the gaming static. Colorado wins the face-off with just 50 seconds left in the second period. Off to Lequiden. Right toward the corner, trying to find the pass to McKenna shot. What a save here by the goaltender. Camillo. Off now to Appleton. The backhander playing and the dryer broken up. Where to then try to go for the bus tempting, and this one's knocked up. And that will end an Appleton shot and a save puts up by Giorgia. Two periods are concluded. We're down to the final one. Close game between the Avalanche Trail by two. We'll get to the third period after this. Are you ready for the third period? It's time to start things down for fourth game. Well, it's been a one wild one. First for the Jets and now for the Avalanche coming into close game. All right, guys, let's have you take care of how they did for the second period. Great static. You're really well enough to play it for so long and ever, but it may not be done yet if you can get that one far enough. The courtesy of this moment just really pushes it out of the way. I really have a lot of hard feeling if you can get there through. Yo, know, you said help me rush. So, oh, what a save here by Brissett. That's a close call. Almost going to give me a close game out there. Shy Feli. Pass again to Villardi shot. Clock by Georgia. Lekernan holding on. And the rebound puts up on the Jets. He finds Shy Feli. Give it again to Morrissey. Lost that puck as Lekernan will grab it. 18.20 to go in the third period. Try to hold on as the Miller will give it off to Villardi. And now Shy Feli. Pass again to Ellers. Ellers can't hold on. Woods got it now. Take the puck steal for Villardi. Now Monaghan will have it out. Try to hold it in between. Here's Wood. Wood inbound. Saved by Brosette. The packing zone. No penalty on the roughing call. Ifos got it now. And now the Jets are back in the offensive territory. Now finding Monaghan. The pass broken up. And there's a penalty call. They're not going to get this one like in it. They're never going to like it. They do not love the slashing call. This one's going to be all over on them. Sharp! Hit the goal post and that one stops the play as this time goes another penalty kill. This is really not what's happening. You can't trip over someone if you are trying to play on the offense. If you're playing defense, don't give a good look on that. Because that will be not a great call. You're going to get that one caught up on your own life. Not another penalty kill, 0-3 for the Avalanche. Now here's another power play for the fourth time. The Jets will take their, will take their puck here. As right now Dylan will try to clear the puck out. Jurgen's going to hold on to that. Nearing the goal line and Jurgen will now give again to Toes. He will try to watch them in here. And Johansson will have it over on the other side of the offense. He finds Colin, shot. This one's blocked up. Dylan trying to hold on with that one. Here's Pionk has it. Attacking offense, and now Toes has got it down for the Colorado zone. In the Winnipeg zone, it's garage shot. Good stop by Dylan. This one goes back to Pionk. That puck deep over here, not enough to get there in timing. And Gerard, shot! Good stop here by Pionk with the pump check. Namsikov, clear the puck out. Oh, Nemsikov, looking to take it! Oh, what a save by Georgia! No sure game to go over this time! Well, the clean look may not be what you're looking for, but that one really has to be the close call for that. Now back to Sandberg, and we'll clear the puck out, and beyond deep in the quarter. Oh, what a good take. Firing around the net, here's I follow. Looks like his time is about to expire. Beyond stopping the puck. 0-4 this time for the Avalanche as their power plays has ended. 
Great chance here, but that problem is going to turn out to be the worst goal for the Winnipeg Jets. If they can get that offense go in there, they're going to let that one get smashed out of here. There's a lot of great takes in here. There's not enough to go with the option. You may not ever going to get there at that time if you get there through. Jeremy is going to hold a whistle there, which is only 14.02 to go in the third period. Now they're ready to do this one again. On to another faceoff. The Jets wins the faceoff. Morrissey's got that puck recovery, and now we'll find it again to Shifeli. Here's a take. DeMello. Shot blocked. And Cullen will have it here. And that pass is broken up, and Velarde will have it over. Looking over, now finding is Cullen. Connor can't hold on with the puck, as Ward will have it. He's getting there close, and a big save here by the goaltender. Connor's got it now. DeMello will have it here. Across the line in scrimmage. Scoop him along the board by Scheifele. Connor shoots! Save by Georgiev. Velarde holds on with the puck here, and now Morsi will have a new changeup in between. Now he's back in the offensive zone to fire the puck out back again to Ellers. Ellers gets the high pop. Shot! And save by Georgiev. Close call on the gap, but he still holds on. Standing tall, it's not what you always think of it, but that was how you do to get that one shut and down. The Jets wins the faceoff. Here's an take for Sandberg, and now here's Schmidt. Looks again, Morrissey! Oh, what a save by Georgia! Trying to hold on with the puck, but it stopped. Well, you know it's going to be like a hard takeover. You're never going to get that call, and you're never going to like that one. But hopefully it will turn out all for best of luck and wish coming in true. Chips wins another faceoff. Three in a row now. And Schmidt will have it over. The offense keeps on coming. mortahan has got the puck. We'll fire it out around the way. Back to I follow. Here's it back to Sandberg. Here's the open look. And that one can't deflect it in that time. Try to hold on with the puck with only 11-10 to go, and Lequinem will have it. Cut him down. Sandberg's got it. Now back to I follow. I follow went down, and Sandberg will have it clear. Try to avoid that tackle. By Ram can't find anybody. Johnston shot. Good block by Motohan. Rantanen, saved by Brozet. Brozet will hold the whistle in here, which is only 10.21 to go. Now the offense is ready to pick up another gas. It's still a 4-2 game. The win puts it for the Jets. Now he will have it over again, now find the Dreiner. He's ready to take it. Oh, what a save by Georgia. That one's going to be a close one in the range out there. Ooh, man. You have to hire one you can. The Jets wins another faceoff, and now Pionk will have it. Get back to Dylan. He finds the Dreider. The Dreider can't hold on with the puck. That range is putting in a lot of motion out there. They will never let that one aggress more, and they are never going to like that one. This one's going to be really like a hard take, and you will never like when this call comes into a roughness in the game. Fionn can't hold on with the puck, and now Byram will have it. Byram gives it over again to McKinnon. Sorry, Wood. Now Colton's got one. This one stopped again, and Fionn gives again to Scheifele. And here's to it. Shot! Good save by Georgia. He's ever again, now ready to take his own time with only 8.37 to go. All pushes again set, ready for another faceoff in the Cavs territory. Now the Avalanche will win their faceoff as O'Connor will give again to McCarr. McCarr, deep pass to Wood. Wood trying to make his way in there. On the shot, and saved by Sprozak. Back to O'Connor and Scheifele with the puck. Clears the board around. The Jets will have their possession in, there in the center of the ice. 
Now in the wing of the territory, give again to Morsi. Here's DeMello, avoids the tackle. Back to Morsi, to DeMello. Puck stolen by O'Connor. Avalanche back in the offensive zone. Morsi trying to hold on with that one. Cohen fouling for the puck. And it's recovered. We'll clear the puck out of here in the end zone. And Icy's whistled up. And he can't find an open man as McCarr will give it back to Wood. Here's Wood on the attacking range in sight. Sandberg, oh, Brozette will hold on. Just 634 left to go in the third period. Trying to hold on with the tackle. Now they're set to do it again. The Jets wins it again, but in our faceoff as, as Sandberg gets to Smith. Winnipeg on the offense, trying to give it up again to Baroon. Icy still whistled off. No backhander given here, as this one gives it back to Baris. Baris, good stop on the puck play as Smith gives again to Baroon. Baroon to Smith, now has it again to Sandberg. Sandberg on his way down. Firing the puck around again, over to Perfetti. Perfetti, on a cart, shot saved by Georgiev. Really saving it in big, and this one is really not what you really have to mention. When Georgiev had that one all coming down, he saw that quick reaction again. Oh, what a save! Another stop put in again for the Jets. Oh, I love that one too. This one's a great one to take off, it's precious though. Yeah, let the fool knock you down. Here's McKinnon. And now back to Namstikov. The tape pressures in. Shows for right below. For two, does it go in? Dillon. Find Smith. Smith takes it again to Dillon. That's broken up. Four minutes to go in the third period. They still have a lot of time to get there. And Bosek. We'll have it in the corner now, and he gives it again to Schmidt, and back to Nemsikov, and we'll fire it out. And I follow, clears it as the icing's waved off. Right to him with the buck steal. A lot of passing, broken up zones, but right to will have that one in. No penalty on Colorado. Here's a shot from McKinnon, shoots, and Pat's saved again by Bozak. And he's ready to take his own time, as Bianca will have it. Oh, avoids that one. Here he comes! Oh, he hits the goalpost! And he comes over with another save. Oh, man. That is too close. Really gonna get that one through. We do have the winning call. Let's go right down the fair. Kyle Connor has been doing really well with his excellent skills. I love when his wheels comes in, and this one's trying to be a great one for us tonight. We'll find if he does have to take the win, if he does have more time to get there by. Great wings comes by for Kyle Connor. Good save! Jorge is going to hold it with only 2.11 to go. We're nearing down the end of the regulation period. It is still 4 2 games. The Jets wins it again. DeMello again to Morrissey. Shoots! Save! We're under two minutes left to go, and we're ready to get an air face off. Now the win for the Jets. Here he comes for DeMello. DeMello tries to hold on. Here's a take. Here we go. We're shot. Oh, Jordan, we're going to save. This one keeps on coming. The fans are on their feet, ready to support for the Jets, looking to get the 3-1 series in Winnipeg. And another win for Colorado. Connor on the full pressure. And this one will clear the puck out of here with 90 seconds. A lot of time left, but there's not enough to get there because they're going to have to find another room to get that one closing the quarter. Shy Fowley, here's a win of the and the Georgia will put it again back to Manson. Final minute remaining in the third period. And the man advantages on. Take away. Good stop by, by Ambrose. And this one will clear the puck out. Bullardi will try to handle it over to Monaghan. Monaghan. Kick it to the The block is shot. 
Like her name, Gifford O'Connor. And this one will not be ticked out. Manson, trying to leave in his own. This one's taking over. Help leaves his own out of here. And we get an icing here for Arnie with Jets. You can feel the energy now. It's still a 4 2 game. Winnipeg. The win for the Jets. This one stopped out. And that one will leave the zone. DeMello. And Ellers. Ellers battling for the puck. Shot. And that's it. Winnipeg Jets earns game four victory. 4 2 is your final score. What a shock and awe moment. They feel like that the crowd is going wild. Ever seen it like the regular season? They've done their best. I always know now we salute to the fans. What a great game this is, and you can support all for a chance of luck. What a fun night this is at Winnipeg. It's now a 3 1 series for the Winnipeg Jets. We'll see if they win, and if they do or die, for the Avalanche. Go well, along with me, OJ, with Paintbrush and Silver Spoon. Thanks for joining with us, and we'll see you next time. Alright guys, thank you so much. What a terrific game this is. Just earned a win in Game 4. Here are your three star players in the game. Third star goes to Miko Rantanen with a goal assist and seven hits. Only had that one with a crazy impact. Second star goes to Dylan DeMello with a goal assist and hit. Only had that one coming in, and this one takes it over. A give and go moment. And your first star player in the game. It goes to Alex Larnett Brozent. 32 saves in the night. From the Golden Knights to the Jets. What a great game this is, and there you have it. Let's have a look here for the, for the courtesy of this lineup here, as I have that one here coming in down. And thanks to Fan, of course, trying to be great. 51 over 34 total shots on goal, and it's 42 over 27 for Colorado. 1151 over 447 for the Winnipeg Jets. 89% passing over, over 72 for the Colorado. 29 over 21 faceoff wins for Colorado. 8 minute penalty kill was the Winnipeg Jets. 04 and 02 in a power play scores with 8 minutes and 4 minutes power play minutes in between. No power play goals, they've done really well. Cleaning the offense, cleaning the air, clearing the fuck out, and you name it, you definitely got it all. Well, that's gonna do here for now. I hope you enjoyed this game. If you're joining us for the next game, we've got the Rangers versus the Tampa Bay Bulls. That'll be underway shortly after this. See you folks next time for the Jets versus the Avalanche for a while as the Stanley Cup playoffs of the NHL 24 dial. This is Son of Beast and Terry Cruz signing you out. Have a great day here in Winnipeg along with the Colorado Mount Rocky Mountains in Mile High. If you don't, if you don't, somebody will.